What's up, what's up friends, this is Dante here and today we are playing Guardian of the Galaxy as I promised and we'll do the whole series, we already done the episode 1, if you missed that you can check that on my channel, so we are gonna do today episode 2, so episode 2 name is Under Pressure, I hope you're gonna enjoy this one, it's gonna be less commentary, much gameplay, because it's a storyteller, I have to shut my mouth sometimes when the important thing is going on in the story, so let's play the shit. Episode 2, here we go. I'm a big fan of the movie, and now I'm a big fan of this game. Last episode was really awesome. If you didn't have to check, you can check. So, previously on, I got of the Galaxy. Smile, son of a you have something I desire. The Eternity Forge. What is your problem, Quill? We just killed the biggest bad guy in the universe, and you can't even let me enjoy it for one second? Haha! <laughs> I keep thinking about Nebula. Imagine how she's gonna react when she finds out we killed Thanos. Like you said, she's your sister. Trust me. Family's worth fighting for. Maybe you're right. Thanos eradicated my people. Destroyed my planet. Now that you have killed him, the Eternity Forge will be our salvation. You have his body? <laughs> I can't believe it. We'll dispatch some officers to your location. The galaxy owes you a debt it can never repay. I will not rest until we have conquered every star system in the galaxy. Oh, I remember this bitch from the episode one. Starting with you. Uh oh, Quill. Oh, come on, bro. Yeah, I remember this shit. Come find me, Peter. <gasps> yeah, that that uh, artifact done the magic work last time, and uh, voila, oh, everything is fine. Holy shit! Yeah, you can say that. Holy shit! I think. Uh, that's the end of the recap of the episode 1, so we're gonna begin episode 2, this game series adapts to the choice you make, the story trail, by how you play. Yeah, I already know that. Shit. No! No! What no, is this no, no, dark no. sorcery? Back foul demon! <laughs> what the hell? Uh... What I am... Here? Whoa! Brute. Hey! This is not normal! Get behind Hello, me! guys! Guys, it's me. It's Peter Lord. Peter. I, uh, S Starquill. Uh, I mean... Peter! Uh, I thought you were... Yeah, so, uh... I guess I was dead, and now uh, apparently I'm not. This is impossible. Impossible is one thing. This? <laughs> this is freaky. How do we know you are really Peter Quill? Prove it to me. What do you expect? <laughs> Only I like. Do? Oh come I on! I like this stand. Who else could master these sick moves? Oh Stop. yeah. Stop doing that with your pelvis. What this? Mm, that is most disturbing. Say <laughs> Okay. I Great. like that. Everybody, calm now. Huh? We cool. We cool? No! I am Groot. Yeah. He's right. <laughs> the dead don't just come back. There's got to be a catch. I mean, this is insane. You see that, don't okay, you? Okay, Rocket, uh, just... Everything comes at a cost. The cost. Just don't know what it is yet. Hey, I'm just happy to be alive, okay? Screw the cost. You don't know anything about this thing, Pete. What if it's temporary? Huh? Well, what if it does something to you? Yeah, easy to say screw the cost when you don't know what that is, you idiot. What was that? What was that? It's Hala. She's caught up to us. Oh, Everyone shit. upstairs, we gotta move. 
I come already on, died come once on. today. I really don't want to try it again. Everyone, hold on. Things are gonna get a little bumpy. Yeah, that'll help. Peter, you just died. Are you sure you're okay to fly? Oh, yes. Oh, hell yes, I can fly. Oh, uh, easy, Quill. That answer your question? <laughs> Not really. I am. Root says he's gonna puke again. <laughs> 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 I don't like his laugh. Oh, that was good, miss. I think we lost her. This hollow lady's relentless. Why'd she want this eternity thing so bad? She had many dead Kree on her ship. We found their stasis pods. Uh, okay. Uh, now I might puke. <laughs> Save it for when we land, buddy. She could create an unlimited army of Kree soldiers. If this relic falls into Hollis' hands, that's bad news. For everybody. Agreed. Although I would relish in killing her. And then bringing her back to life. And then killing her again. <laughs> And then bringing her back to life and then killing her again. <laughs> oh, dang. And then bringing her back to life <laughs> and again, killing Max. her again. <sighs> now that will be a fair fight. Yeah, this thing went so well last time. You know, I'm all for people having opinions, but sometimes Drax shouldn't be allowed to speak. Then we can't risk her getting a hold of this relic. Can't the galaxy stay guarded for like five friggin' minutes? I mean, come on! No matter how far we run, Hollow will not stop hunting us. What the fuck? Can't take much more of this, Pete. I barely got her up and running after your last so-called landing. If we don't find some place to lay low and fix our yeah, ship, yeah, I'm on it. Look, I just need her to hold together for a little longer, Rocket. I might know someone who can help us out. Guardian of the Galaxy. Here we go. Rezak. Neon District. Okay. We're gonna visit this planet. Under pressure. Episode 2. Where are we? I don't like being out in the open with Hala on our trail. I am Groot. Let me do the talking. Okay, let's try to peek fast. Quill? If you're here, trouble ain't far behind. My ship's busted, man. And you're the only guy who can fix it. <sighs> now, this is why you never loan stuff to people. Haven't seen you since you left me in the Ravages. I hear you're a real hero now. Been helping out them Nova Corp boys. You think I'm letting you in now? You've lost the other half of your mind. <sighs> Never thought you'd turn into a spineless, rule-following space cop yourself. Hey, you practically raised me, man. Look, my mom said you're responsible for whatever happens to me. The least you can do is let me the in. The least I can do is nothing. Well, you better come on in then before someone sees you. Make yourself right at... Home? Oh yeah, I don't remember this dude. Oh, uh, he was, uh, I it was just you, the Quill. same dude Not from the dream name. of uh, Quill in the first episode. He raised uh, Quill. Hey, hey, no plants on the roof. These are my friends, Yandu. Great, okay, quick introductions then. This is Gamora. See now, nice to meet you. Put that away, or I'll cut it off. Oh. 
That's Groot. I'm Groot. Drax, say hi. These are terrible. How oh, dare you? Still eating. My. A warrior must eat. And last but not okay. least, Rocket. R Rocket! I don't trust Ravagers, Quill. They'll shoot you in the back the first moment they get. Well, I don't trust animals that can talk. Want to hear me talk? Okay. Rocket, <laughs> we are guests inside Yondu's beautiful home. Please don't blow it and everyone inside of it to tiny little pieces. This place is already a garbage heap. A little kaboom would do it good. What the hell? <laughs> I've been buying black market trinkets off this little freak for years. And I okay, they already know each other. They were just messing anything around with the quill. Well, we got some. But it ain't for sale. Well, ain't she a beauty? What the f shit you gonna, gonna tell me about this? Know anything about this shit? Space. You ever heard of it? Nothing comes to mind. Then again. Let me see that thing. Oopsie. Beautiful. Sometimes it takes stepping back from your problems to see how small they actually are. These last few months haven't been easy. For either of us. But, um... I'm not always gonna be here. That was the same dream uh, that we saw in... Uh, I worry about you. Episode 1? It's a memory. So Don't say stuff like that. This isn't easy for me, either. You're meant for more than this life, Peter. I know you are. You're gonna save the galaxy. You're gonna kill Thanos. And change everything. Wait, this this isn't how it happened. You you didn't say that before. Please yeah. Trust me, baby. I'm trying to help you. Hmm. Every time I look up there, I find something new. Something I overlooked. Come sit by me, baby. Hmm? You can see the stars even better from over here. Peter, please. Just for a little bit. No. I'm cool right here. Suit yourself. Wow, this so looks beautiful. What am I supposed to be looking at? The stars. I know they don't look like much. That's Orion. No doubt about it. <laughs> it is indeed. First constellation you ever learned. Something is glowing. I think that one is Canis Major? It's shaped like a dog. That's right. You wanted a pup so badly when you were younger. But you could never have one. Too much money. Closest thing you were ever gonna get was that constellation. You used to wish that dog sweet dreams every single night. Gemini, right? The twins? Yep. You used to say they were dancing together. Yeah. I thought it was you and, and Dad. You have one active imagination, Peter. Hmm. Back 
to the stars. Uh, look at this one. That looks like the Eternity Forge. Sure does. Look closer. I'm oh writing. yeah, it just uh, it wasn't looks there like same like uh, that relic. What? What does it say? Mom? Come find me, Peter. Come find me, Peter. Okay, so they both were watching that. Guys. I don't think they can hear us. Did you just see what I saw? It's been decades since I've seen your mama's face. Now that was a special treat. Peter? Something was off about that memory. That wasn't how the night ended. Can't help you. I wasn't there the first time. What just happened? I saw my mom. You heard her, right? She wants me to find her. Wait, look. Wait. I've seen glyphs like that before. It's ancient Cree. Stop eating already! Tell you! hear myself think. Yuck, why does everything have to be Cree? You did find it in a Cree temple. Details. Nah. I don't think it's a coincidence, though. Thanos was after something. An object with these same markings. Let me see that. Nebula and I stole it for him. I don't know what it does, but my sister may have been able to learn something from it. If we can find Nebula, Maybe she can help us translate this. Yeah, right before she cuts off all our heads and takes the forge for herself. And who do you think's the first guy she's Never gonna use? her sister. Uh, she's gonna be mad. You worry too much. Because in the first episode we kill we his have dad. We figure this out before Hala does. Kill her dad. Are you hearing yourself? Every story you tell us about that robo chick ends with somebody getting eviscerated. And that is something I'd like to avoid for the foreseeable future. You know, ever since I was a kid, I've wanted to fight a cyborg. I mean, guess dreams do come true. Sorry to crush your dreams, but we might not have to fight her. Oh, you're no fun. I tried to get in contact with Nebula not long ago. She won't be hard to track down. Better let me have a look at your ship, then. I may have something to fix that lying around. Move your foot. I am Groot. Tell you. Somebody get this tree away from me. I love Enough it, man. With the it's so funny. Could you be any more useless right now? You don't like it, but you keep on eating that. <laughs> What's up, man? Is everything okay? Look, I'm no good at this, so I'm just gonna do it fast. I know we don't know a ton about the relic, but the one thing we do know is that it brought you back to life. Don't tell me you ain't thought about how you can use that power. My mom. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You don't know a lot about me. But before I met you guys, there was someone. She's gone now, but maybe with that relic I can make her... ungone. I just... I have to try. Is that your go girlfriend? Happy. I know going Sorry, after Mom, Nebula is a know. logical move here. I get it. You gotta find out why this thing's affecting you. But this favor, I gotta ask. I ain't told anybody about this before. If this person means that much to you. We'll go. Really? Thanks. I mean it. Yeah, I want to see that boy. also. That's why I choose that decision. Your friend over here keeps dropping it on my foot. It slipped. <clears throat> Let's get going. Okay, let's fix this ship and get out of here. That'll do it. 
Have that little furball of yours give her a good rev to warm up the engines. Should be right to go. Where are we going, Star-Lord? We got a little detour to make. Right, Quill? Rocket has some business to take care of on Half-World. We don't have time for a detour. We've got more urgent problems to deal with right now. Ha <laughs> he's angry. There's something you need to see. Hey, you promised. We're going. I found Nebula. She's taken Thanos' mm -hmm. ship. She's heading to a remote Novacore outpost. Peter. She's going after Thanos' body. And we're supposed to care because... I made a promise to Rocket. They're just gonna have to wait. Forget your promise! We need her to help us translate the Eternity Forge. Nebula isn't going to just wait for us to intercept her. Look, a promise is a promise. Pete and I are going to Half-World. Intercepting Nebula is more important. You don't get to say what's more important. We're going to Half-World. Thanks, buddy. I owe you one. Peter, but Nebula... Good luck translating the Forge without my sister. Okay. I was awkward, but I made that decision. Let's see what's gonna happen next. Heads up, everyone. We're going to half world. Later, Queen. Don't be a stranger. And take care of the Milano. Yeah, let's never do this again, okay? Great. Don't forget who raised you, boy. <laughs> Okay. Bye, Hala has found us. And this is what we call great timing. Half wall. Abandoned lab. So let's see. Um, Rocket lost who and who he wants to come back. Let's see. What is this place? Home. I haven't been back here since. Thanks for trusting me, Rocket. I'm glad you brought me here. This isn't what we're here for. Come on. Okay, that might be that grave. Rocket, let me... Let me help you. Don't touch her! Who is she? Who is she? Rocket? Uh-oh. Okay, he's gonna see what's gonna happen. Subject seems to be responding well to the program. Vital okay. signs are good. Still no rejection of the artificial vertebrae or neural implants. The only one who wasn't a total failure. Everything rests on you, my little friend. Rocket. You okay? Okay. Uh, she I was heard her girlfriend. Screaming in there. Girlfriend? These walls I don't aren't know. exactly soundproof. Not that he cares. My befriend. Oh, great. Just wonderful. Nothing like getting random bits of metal shoved under your skin. 
If I'd known you liked it so much, I'd have let you take my turn. So, did you get it? You mean this? <laughs> Wait, it's the right one, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, that's it. Once that computer's finished, we can finally break out of here. Advanced security. Supposedly unhackable blast doors. Piece of cake, right? You sound worried. Hey, you can do this. Just stick to the plan. I won't let you down, Lila. I know. Catch! Oh, I get it. Nice. You're making this look way too easy. Power source. Designed by yours truly. Okay, moment of truth. Go ahead and hook it up to the underside. Ah! <sighs> Stupid piece of junk. You know, your ear twitches when you're frustrated, right? It's cute. Oh yeah? You're cute. I meant that as an insult. <laughs> I'm so offended. Why do you keep doing that with your face? It's called smiling. You should try it sometime. Happy? <laughs> <laughs> I like his smile. Okay, let's try this shit again. Come on, come on. It worked or not? Let's see. Now, all I need is a display and we're in business. Yes! Now we just sync it to the facility's network. I keep having that dream. Still? I'm outside again, in the fresh air somewhere. It's warm, bright. Can't hear a thing except the river rushing by. It felt so real. I can barely remember. It's been so long. Lila, there's something you should see. They're gonna put you down. No. Tail. I won't let them. We have to get these cages open. There should be a hallway just outside that door. From there, we make a break for the main entrance. When I get out, I'm gonna find that place. And I want you to come with me. We'll find the river. I know it's got to be out there. Will you come with me? I gotta find my own way out there. You understand, don't you? I... I get it. Hide it, quick! Subject 89P14. Still no progress. <sighs> Begin prepping lethal injection. Rocket? I can't. You got claws, don't you? Well, that idiot thinks we're nothing but a bunch of animals. So let's show him how right he can be. Yeah. Rocket, I... Ah! Lila! Fuck. Lila!
Oh shit, I missed that. Injection. No. Thought maybe I'd make it slower than I thought. <laughs> oh, this can't be happening. I'm sorry. There you are. Yeah. Kill them. I'll create a distraction. Buy you time to get out. Tell you. I can still cause a little chaos before it kicks in for good. I might as well try to take a few of them down with me, right? You go, Rocket. They'll be sorry for what they did to us. No, no, you're not dying. I won't let this happen. Please, don't make this any worse than it has to be. Survive, Rocket. Uh oh. Come on. Go! You need to get out now! I'm not asking you again. If you're gonna run, run! Come on. We're getting out of here. Both of us. Rocket, please. I've got you. Come on, come on, come on, we can do this. Yeah, you're <laughs> out. Don't you leave me. Never. I never told you. I... This is a sad moment. Oh, damn. Lila? I wish that really can uh, no, make no. her come back. <laughs> Let's see what's gonna happen next. That's so sad. What just... You had no right to see that. Those are my memories. Look, hey, listen. I'm sorry. Little late for that. Well, I still mean it. Come on, Relic. Do the magic. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's not working. It didn't even work! How could it not work? Come on. I was worried this might happen. Okay, we don't completely understand this thing. Not really. Yeah, a lot of good that does me now. Yeah. 
Just take it. I'm sorry I dragged you out here. That was bad, it didn't work. Thanks for, you know, going with me. I know you had other things to do. Anytime, Rocket. What are friends for? No, 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 come on. Please don't do this. I gotta go. Good. You're back. Looks like Nebula started tearing up the Novacor outpost. Hopefully we can still catch her. Carbon emissions are good, engines are all running smooth, some funky red light is blinking. Meh, that's probably fine. On, Rex. You doing all right? I could not protect you, Peter Quill. As hard as I tried, you were still killed by Hala. When Thanos was alive, I was a warrior with a singular purpose. But now, I am useless. The others have made that very obvious to me. I could not save you from Hala. And now that Thanos is gone, you no longer need me. Oh, come on, Drax, cheer up. Look, you gotta see the positive in things. Remember, every cloud has a silver lining. I do not think they do, Peter. Clearly my skills, they are no longer as helpful as I had hoped. You should try talking to the others. You know, maybe they can teach you something new, help you find a, a new purpose. Who would you suggest? <sighs> I don't know. Go see if Rocket will give you some lessons. He's pretty handy. I have hands. <laughs> Maybe you can work on those figures of speech, too. Yes. I will ask the rodent. I should get going. Star-Lord. You still seem troubled by the visions of your mother. I am here to comfort you about such matters. Unless you do not wish to speak of it. No. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. No need to worry about me. You are lying. I respect that. Leaders lie through their emotions. Uh, if you say so. <laughs> you are a good leader, Peter Quill. Because you are a liar. Right. Not a good liar, but an adequate liar. Noted. Okay. That was a nice moment. Rex will learn, uh, go and learn to the rocket. Okay, what's next? What's next? Uh, I need to find other people. Hey, Drax. Hey, where's Rocket? I, I told you to talk with him. I did. He gave me an important mission to find a tool that has gone missing. Oh, okay, cool. Glad you're able to help him out. <laughs> I know. 
Uh, Rocket is playing with him, just only playing with him. Hey, there is Groot. Hello, Groot. Hey, Groot. I am Groot. You think Rocket's gonna be okay? I'm worried about him. I am Groot. Well, this has been a lively and fascinating conversation. <laughs> I am Groot. Groot. Okay, let's talk to Rocket. Hey, Rocket, bro. Open your home to a bunch of misfits, and what do you get? Slobs. Peter, that's what you get. Ran into Drax. I see you're keeping him busy. Yeah, I sent the boulder off in search of an Arcturan screw. Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> Doesn't exist. Just wanted to get the big lug off my back. He won't shut up. Watch this, dude. Why are you hitting that? <laughs> you know, you should be nicer to him. Okay, he's going through a crisis. Or something. Aren't we all? Look, it's not hurting anybody. He feels important. I get some alone time. It won't hurt his feelings unless someone spills the beans. I'll leave you alone. Later, Quill. Okay, are you down here? I'm gonna find a girl. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Is it the pilot station on the bridge to travel Nova Crops? Okay, I think we have to go up. <laughs> it's funny how alien all my earth junk starts to look after a while. Let's go. Hey, everybody to the bridge. We're going to the Nova Corps outpost to intercept Nebula. Wow, this looks beautiful. the fuck? We need backup! All pilots, fall back and engage the fugitive! But sir, we'll lose the body! That is not our priority now! Engage Nebula immediately! Ugh, I knew this would happen. We should have come right away. She's already got Thanos' body. We can't lose her too. Rocket was my priority. He needed me. I needed you too, Peter. Star-Lord! We weren't expecting the Guardians to show up. Hey, what's going on? It's Thanos' right hand, Nebula. She appeared out of nowhere, killed several of our soldiers, and sent Thanos' body off in his ship. She's protecting its escape in a stolen Star Blaster. We can still take her down. Weapons loaded. Lethal force has been sanctioned. Get into position. Okay. No! I'll be damned if I let the Nova Corps blow my sister to Stardust. <laughs> we need her alive. Otherwise, we've got no chance of translating the Eternity Forge. Ready? On my orders. Hey, uh, whatever your name is. Rooks, sir. You can call me Rooks. If you want. It's kind of a nickname. Look, Rooks. 
We've got this covered. Why don't you leave the cyborg to us? I, uh... <laughs> well, of course, we'll take all the help we can get, sir. But the Nova Corps have a duty to fulfill. It would be an honor to fight alongside you. Fire when ready. Okay. When words don't work, there's always firepower. Okay, I just take them whoa, both whoa, out. Hey, hey, what are you doing? Stopping you. Guardians, fall back. If you do not follow orders, we will be forced to return fire. No! Star-Lord, we have to follow protocol. Please listen to him. Nova officers, form a blockade. Peter Quill, by order of the Nova Corps, you will stand down and submit to capture. Now that Thanos is dead, she's guilty of multiple crimes. We have explicit orders to eliminate her immediately. We can't afford to be lenient here. It's too risky. Not if you leave her in our custody. Killing her isn't the only option. Look, Nebula is important to us. She's got something we need, and we need her alive to save the galaxy. But, sir... You want to see the galaxy destroyed? N no, sir, I don't. Which is why I have to do this. You better I listen tried. to Quill. Officer Rooks, signing off. I hope we can still be friends and he on the morning. I think that went well. <laughs> We've got targets on us. On it. That's the last of them. Hold on. Peter Quill, I wasn't expecting you to show your face. Couldn't let the Nova Corps claim your glory. You had to kill me yourself. You brought this upon yourself. Whoa, I'm not a killer, Nebula. That's not why we're here. You murdered Thanos! That makes you a murderer. Look, we need your help. You have to come with us. I will never help you. Okay, now what? Uh, you just had to make this difficult. Disabling her engines. Come on. Come on, field's too dense. I can't get a clear shot. We'll have to force her out. Gamora, take the controls. I'm going in to grab Nebula. Watch yourself. She may be incapacitated, but she's still dangerous. Peter, her ship is drifting into the planet's gravity field. You need to hurry. I'm doing that. I'm doing that. Knock, knock. Go away. I refuse to accept your help or your pity. I'd rather die here. I failed, Father. Again. Leave me here. But, if you die now, hurtling to your death in a fiery hunk of metal, how will you avenge Thanos? You're running out of time. Give me a sec. I think I'm getting through here. No. Oh, oh. Uh -oh. Oh, shit. 
God damn. Broke her hand. There goes the ship. Gonna be destroyed. That's the last of it. I don't like knowing Thanos' body is out there somewhere. Oh, one thing at a time. We have to figure out how this relic works before we start worrying about the dead guy. We're running a scan of her cybernetics, but it's taking some extra time. Just to be safe. We need to get Nebula to help us decipher these symbols. Just watch yourself, Peter. She's not exactly happy to be here. Okay, she's definitely not happy to be here. Yeah, I don't really blame her. Her dad's dead, we beat her up, and then she gets locked in her sister's room. She's not having the best couple of days. It is what she deserves for serving Thanos. Rocket may be able to get her arm working again. We could use it as leverage. <laughs> Don't bother. We are going to dismantle this cyborg piece by piece. Fear won't work on someone like Nebula. You'll just rile her up. <laughs> good. Not good. She was trained to slaughter thousands. She may hate you, but she does not fear you. I know you're good at knives, but trust me, you attract more flies with honey. What would you want with flies? That's not the point. Flies are a nuisance. You okay to go in there? Frankly, no. I'm not okay. I wanted to reconnect with Nebula. You told me to reconnect with her, and then this happens. Maybe she'll come around someday, but I can't see her wanting to reconcile anytime soon. Oh, come on, just do it. Hey, Nebula. Neb. Can I call you Neb? <laughs> Oh, hey, 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 do you mind not inviting me? I just want to talk like two civilized people. Can we do that? That's really up to you, isn't it? Thanos wanted this relic. And I know he had you learn how to read these glyphs. That's the Eternity Forge. You've heard of it? How did you make those runes appear? I thought it didn't work. I was, uh, <laughs> dead. Forge resurrected me. These symbols appeared some time after that. So it works. I need you to help me translate them. That's not gonna happen. You think I'd so easily betray my father? We are not all so spineless. Okay. What if I sweeten the deal? Look, you help me with this one teensy tiny little thing and I will let Rocket reattach your arm. I know you have no intention of helping me. She wants to see me suffer. Killing our father wasn't enough for you. You have to rub it in my face, too. He raised you, Gamora. He loved you. That was not love, Nebula. And you let this imbecile murder him! You were the reason he's gone. You're the one who ruined my life. Whoa, this is a happy place. There's no need for that kind of name-calling. I mean, really. Imbecile. Oh, sorry I hurt your delicate little feelings. That's enough, Nebula! You pass judgment on me. On my father. But I know you, Gamora. You may have forgotten Tarball, but I haven't. I'm warning you, never, never to speak the name! Tarball, Tarball! I'll get what we need from you, one way or another. You want me to talk? Get rid of her! Don't be ridiculous, Nebula! I have nothing to say to you. I'll make you talk. You know I can. I think Amora's got the right idea, actually. Ah, uh. uh, real mature. You both should watch your backs. Shackles won't keep me tethered for long. And once I'm free, you'll be sorry. You're the one who will be sorry, Nebula. 
I won't go easy on you again. Leave Gamora alone. I can fight my own battles, Peter. I don't need your help. Oh, poor Star-Lord. Sounds like she doesn't care about you. And you can stop twisting my words, sister. Star-Lord, the scan found something. A strange device in the cyborg's skull. Nebula, I know... I know you hate me. And maybe that will never change. But I have to try. I am trying. One call isn't enough. It's a start, though, isn't it? I can't wait to see your face when you lose everything. When I take what you took from me, you'll have to watch as everyone you care about dies. Then maybe we'll be even. Hey, you do what you have to do, Gamora. I'm not gonna stand in your way. Stop! Please. Ah, uh, she's afraid. I'll give you what you want. Oh. This will tell you what you need to know. Now get out. Gladly. I almost... I told myself I wasn't going to be that person anymore. She just gets under my skin. Are you kidding? That was awesome! Uh... <laughs> are you serious? I see yeah. you tried my plan. <laughs> the important thing is we got the uh, the Kree thingy. So oh, that is a cipher module. There are not many left in existence. All right. So how does this work? I think I can upload this to my own translator. Downloading language quicks. Okay, it says, come find me in the temple. Helpful. God, didn't we find it in a temple? My mom said the same thing when I died. But maybe we missed something. We were a little preoccupied at the time. Come find me. Who do you think me is? That temple was completely abandoned when we showed up. Except for all the dead Nova Corps bodies that Thanos put there. It's gotta be my mom. If you think it is, then I hope you're right. Let's get moving. We're going back to the temple. We're going back to the temple. Where's Identified Rocket? Planet? Almost there. I have not seen him emerge. Hang on, I'll call him. Hey, Rocket, we need you up here. I think you can handle a freaking temple without me. I guess he doesn't want to talk. Well, Rocket is in no shape to guard Nebula. Someone's got to stay back and keep an eye on her. I will stay behind to guard the prisoner. Um, hang on. No, you won't. Drax is good at a lot of things, but guarding people is not one of them. You took him to Hall's ship, and he let you die. His health has improved greatly since then. <laughs> you heard him before. He Damn. I did say that. Does this mean you're volunteering, Gamora? Yes, I'll guard her. No! You cannot be seriously considering this. He let Hollis stab you, Peter. Right in the chest. No offense, Drax, but I'm the right person to guard my sister. Nebula is my responsibility. Your record on that matter is questionable. Gamora, you should stay behind and keep an eye on Nebula. Maybe it'll give you a chance to talk. Thank you, Peter. You are both foolish. Let us return to the temple. I will be ready when you are. Fool. I am Groot. If 
find me in the temple. Find me in the temple. Let's go find out who's waiting for us. Let's go, let's go, let's go! I, uh... <laughs> I forgot how slow this elevator was. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I do not like being back in this wretched place. Well, this ain't a field trip, Drax. The markings on the forge said, find me in the temple. So, here we are. In a temple. Yeah, that's the place Again. we uh, fight. Hello? Anyone here? In the first episode? Yes, I am here, as is Groot. But I should be guarding Nebula on the ship. We've been over this, Drax. So, why don't we just spread out? Look for secret doors or passages or whatever. I've got my scanner. If anyone's here, we'll find them. Okay. Well, these footprints are fresh. Someone's been busy in here. Oh, crap. What was she doing here? Star-Lord! It's Hala! Oh my god! Oh god! Why? <laughs> I saved you. That was a hologram, you big dope! <laughs> Look! Where did they go? They went up. Oh, damn. It's so funny. Okay, there is something. Examine. Looks like some kind of button. Ah, so push that button. Okay, so much for that. Ah, nothing happens. Okay, so much for that. Okay, it's not working. Let's go down. There's still more footprints. What is she doing? Whatever they were trying to do, looks like they needed the forge to do it. Score one for the good guys. I am Groot! Man, Thanos really packed a punch. <laughs> I still can't believe we all survived that fight. I am Groot. Footprints over here. Well, this is where Thanos found the Eternity Forge. Hey. Hollow was here too. Her hand is going through the wall. Okay, let's check this shit. There's something behind here. 
Hello? Anybody home? She's doing okay. Let's talk to Drax. Hey, Drax, what you think? Looks like Thanos's armor didn't exactly protect him. Good. It is a comfort to know the Mad Titan was mortal after all. Hey, group. Hey. You think I chose the right person to guard Nebula, right? I am Groot. Right. Thanks, pal. Have you seen anyone around who seems like they might know what an Eternity Forge is? I am Groot. Oh, something over there I should look at? Well, thanks, Groot. Okay. Keep up the good work. Let me see. Let me see what we are missing here. Still, this should not. Work. Oh, there are more of them. I don't need to use that. Huh? Nothing from this one either. Let's try another one. There is one more. No button on this one. Okay, no button on this one. There is two buttons. Still not uh, working. That's not working. them at the same time okay quill I apologize for my outburst on the ship However, I should have been the one to guard the cyborg instead of Gamora. Gamora has too much of an attachment to her sister. She might let her feelings get in the way. This mission here is super important, Drax. I needed you by my side. No other place I'd want you to be. I couldn't let you guard Nebula and come on this mission. Can't have your cake and eat it too, you know. You are right. I could not do both. I just wanted to share my thoughts. And I am confident, I would be able to eat many cakes. You see that bad boy? He does not seem particularly ill-tempered. Uh, look, whatever, fine. Just press the button on his helmet when I say so, okay? Okay, let's do this shit. That's, how, that's what a wife wants. Tracks? You ready? Okay. okay. One, two, three. 
What happened? <laughs> you went early. No, I didn't. One, two, three, go. I was waiting for the go. Oh, <laughs> okay. One, two, three, go. And it's Christmas. Yeah. Open sesame. Check this out. That definitely looks like the Eternity Forge. Yeah. And those souls are being absorbed by it. That's why it didn't work for Rocket. It wasn't charged. Look at this. And here is where Hala failed. No Eternity Forge, no prize. Here goes nothing. Oh. What does it say? Hang on. Let's see if Nebula's Cypher was worth all the trouble. The Eternity Forge resides here, pending such time as it can be wielded responsibly. Until then, she shall remain entombed across the galaxy. Huh. So, this is not the correct temple? We came here for nothing. Hang on a second, there's more. It says... Emnios? The temple we're looking for is on a place called Emnios. And these symbols are a star. Emnios. <laughs> I know how to get there. Gamora. Peter. Whoever we're looking for isn't here, but we figured out where to find him. Get those engines fired up. We're going for a ride. Um, about that. Rocket's down in the engine room. He's uh, yelling some new and creative curse words. Yeah, you might want to talk to him. Okay. What happened to Rocket? <laughs> what happened to you? Look, I know you miss Lila. That's okay. <laughs> I don't... I don't... <laughs> hey, 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 what's, what's going on? Talk to me. I didn't uh, didn't want you to uh, to see. She's gone. And she was the only thing keeping me alive. And I couldn't save her. She protected me. And I couldn't. You loved her, didn't you? Yeah. I did. Never told her though. Thought I had time. I thought if I could just get her out of there, and she could just see it. This is all I have left of her. This stupid computer. I can't do this without it, Pete. I thought I could, but I can't. I can't. That's why I'm gonna help you. And you're gonna get through this. I can't lose her again. I can't fix it this time. There's nothing left. I, I still can't. I don't want to give her up. That's all I got. You should hold on to it, Rocket. It means a lot to you. <laughs> What's going on? 
Get the Eternity Forge, keep it safe. Go help Rocket. What are you gonna do? What the hell? They're in the ship? Oh shit. I don't remember inviting you two. Oh, that's right. Yeah, it's There's no take care of space. That. Oops. Wait! Let me fight. You trapped me on this piece of junk, and now we're surrounded by pissed off Kree. I don't want to die here, and neither do you. If you keep me here, they'll kill you, your friends, and then they'll come for me, too. Let me out. Without me, you're just gonna get us all killed! Okay, but one move against my crew. Any of them gets hurt, and this little trust exercise is over. Do you understand? I understand. Okay, I know I'm doing the wrong thing, but... Uh, let's try. So Nebula is right with us. These irksome invisible side. enemies! Cowards! <laughs> Drax, you okay? Drax! Not okay. <laughs> Not okay. Hurry! Gamora! I should have guessed Nebula wouldn't pass up the chance to fight. Well, someone on this ship has to keep you all alive. Here! This one's yours. I'm not a punch. Uh-oh. Oh. Holy shit. That's my seat! Almost like old times, isn't it? <sighs> Never gets any easier. Okay, that'll do it. We've got to move. Now! <sighs> Couldn't have said it better myself. Is the engine room. Rocket! Nebula and I will keep the bridge secure. Just get the power back on. I am Groot. Okay, Rocket. Groot is hurt. Engine. Rocket! Ha! Oh, shit. Son of a bitch. You think you could possibly win against the Kree? Now that I've obtained the Eternity Forge for Hala. Ah, oh, stop, dude. Just... Just stop. I really don't care. How dare you speak to me like that? How dare I? You come on my ship, you bust up my team, and then you go about spouting your evil plan like a bad monster movie? Hold your tongue! Hala will! Oh, Hala can kiss my beautiful Ooh. Earth ass! <laughs> 
What is Rocket planning? Hey guy, what's it like being on fire? Ah! That bad, huh? <laughs> Stupid. Okay, that was good. You must think you're clever, Peter Quill, but you can't run forever. The forge will be mine. Do not be foolish. Who says I'm running? Is there another word you would prefer? Hiding. Cowering. I'm not afraid of you. I do not need you to be afraid. <sighs> Peter, you better get the engines running. The Revenant's weapons are coming online. Rocket! Okie dokie! Gamora, set a course for Emineos. Drop off our stowaways on the way there. She is. I hope I'll get to see her again. Talk to her. Just one more minute. You'd do almost anything to get that. I mean, if you could bring your mom back, what then? You still gonna be doing this? Oh, come on, I wouldn't do that to you guys. The Guardians stick together, no matter what. And what, Meredith Quill becomes our new pilot? This is it. Okay, this is the temple that we're looking for. Is here a temple? I don't know. So, what now? I'm sure Peter has a plan. You do have a plan, right? I know what I'm doing, guys. Trust me. Can't argue with that. Yeah, that's the temple. Wow. So, we're gonna enter the ship, let's see, much light. Can't hear anything. Peter, look! What? Suspense! Episode ends! Wow! That was an uh, exciting episode, so... We're gonna wait for the episode 3, what's gonna happen next! So, I hope you enjoyed this one! Do not forget to hit the like and subscribe us for more of these videos! And do not forget to come back on our channel for episode 3 as soon as it's released! We gonna upload that shit on the, my channel! So, I hope you enjoyed it! I'm a big fan of this movie! And this is series. I hope you do 
do not forget to share your views follow us on twitter the link in the description below thanks for watching and have a nice day